Hey there, Builder Blog. We're here with the Battle Hex, and we're getting ready to take it to Robo Games. And uh, Dan and Chewy are helping me try to get this in the van today, which is right over, right over there. So, oh, oh, Chewy, Chewy, can, can we bring Vlad? Can we bring Vlad? Tell me we can bring Vlad. There's already a Vlad showing up. Oh! I have no idea what it's going to be, but we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> so, Dan, what, what are you bringing to Robo Games? Uh... I'm bringing a little thing that's a little solar power dealy, and then I'm bringing a little thing with a piece of uh, muscle wire that moves. And nothing that fights, I'm sorry. Boom! <laughs> Chewy, are you bringing anything that fights? Uh, yeah, I've got a 60 pounder. It's called a uh, little kahuna. The little kahuna. <laughs> yeah, it's over in the other room. Oh, oh. I, I haven't touched it in like three or four years, so it'll be fine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> And what are you currently sweeping? Uh, this treadmill. Hat. Is it is it part of your Robo Games experience? Uh, parts of it are being turned into another robot. So sure. <laughs> <laughs> is this you prepping for Robo Games right here? Uh, some, they might make an appearance. We'll see. All right. Well, I wish you luck. And uh, Builder Blog, wish us luck. We're gonna see if we can get a seven hundred pound crate in a van without a forklift. Let's do it. Let's go. Okay, going in. Well, ladies and gentlemen, through the magic of Dan and Chewy, we have the RoboGames Arena for the Insect Divisions loaded. Thank you, Chewy. Hey, success. All right, thank you, Dan. Now we're just gonna secure it, take out the winch, and uh, we're good to go, right? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> and we remembered grabby arm, most important tool. Oh my God! Robo games in that four days. Quick, fix it, fix it, fix it, fix it. I, I'm currently up to 32 working robots. And I just need to finish 10 more in four days. It's fine. It's completely fine. This is a doable schedule. Uh, some of you may know, I was originally intending to bring Scorpios to Robo Games. Unfortunately, my work shipped me out to Texas for uh, a whole month. And uh, it was great getting to meet all the Texas builders. I, I don't want to be completely down on my Texas trip because I got to meet a lot of really nice folks in Texas, and we got to have some amazing episodes. And if you guys haven't watched those episodes yet, we did meet up with the uh, Sub-Zero team, Triton team, and Switchback team, along with Witch Doctor and Hypershock in the South by Southwest video. And we got to see close-up looks of all those robots. So the Texas trip definitely was, had its benefits. But, uh... Due to that, I, I was originally going to enter four robots in Robo Games, and we're only going to enter two. But I do need to get Bot Bash working. Bot Bash is going to have a booth with 40 robots at it, so you can pick any two battle, any two of my Bot Bash robots, and fight them. And I just fixed Beetle. There's number 32. Oh, God. I have to go get more robots. Be right back. I can fix this one, it'll be number 33. Just a quick, huge cleanup. Perfect. All right, what's wrong with this robot? Uh, the cables are dead. Okay, let's fix that. I, I am frantically panicking trying to get all these robots ready, but if you've ever wanted to see heavyweight combat in person, uh, now is your chance. There are still tickets available for Robo Games. Uh, they are sixty dollars for an adult, and children under six are free. Um, they it is very loud. Uh, you have no idea how much the TV show kind of dampens the noise. I know most like wrestling things they try to make it sound louder, but believe it or not, we actually make it sound quieter. <laughs> And uh, if you do have young kids and you're coming to Robo Games, you should really bring some earmuffs for them. Because when you hear uh, 
Tombstone or Manta or any of these robots spin up, they're loud. And when you hear them hit something, they're even louder. Uh, seeing Robot Fighting Live is really amazing. I fell in love with Robo Games when I was a kid. And uh, I came every single year. It got me to actually stick with engineering and become an engineer. So, I cannot say enough positive things about Robo Games. There's a done robot sitting in this drawer. Um, I would say don't build 42 robots for Robo Games. That's what I'm doing. There's my favorite screwdriver. Uh, where's my stripper? You never have a stripper when you need one. Uh, don't take that out of context. God, Diana's going to take that out of context. But please come to Robo Games. If you want to meet me and Diana, we are going to be there all... I'm going to be there every day. Diana's going to be there Saturday and Sunday. Uh, we will be at the Insect Arena. Please feel free to come by and say hi. I swear to God, we're nice. You'll notice I'll be very stressed and sweating. You know, exactly how you want to meet me. But it's this week in San Jose, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Tickets are still available for all of them. We're going to put a link in the description. Buy tickets, come, watch robots. It'll be amazing. And hopefully I can fix this one. And then, if you really want, you can come drive Star Fox. Yeah, Star Fox. All right, guys. I have 10 more robots to finish, and I don't have much time to do recording this week. But uh, to all my competitors who are probably waiting for insect updates, I want you to know my wonderful sponsor, Van Bever Brothers, made me a one-piece steel floor for my arena. I know the captain of Gigabyte is currently screaming, finally! And uh, my other amazing sponsor, Bishop Weiscarver, is going to help me pick it up and transport it to San Jose, because that stupid one-piece floor is 270 pounds, which is the whole reason I didn't want to get it. But I know the builders want it, and I am a man of the people. So, uh, big thank you to my sponsors, Van Bevers and Bishop Weiscarver, for making that happen. I'm going to be putting their stickers on the arena to say thank you for that. And uh, please, if you've ever wanted to meet me, I promise to be in a better mood than I am right now. Uh, come to Robo Games, say hi, uh, watch some fights, watch some robots explode. And then go home and tell your friends how cool it was. Actually, bring your friends with you. Um, these smaller tournaments really do need help. They really do need ticket sales. They need people to show up. We need people to take an interest in the sport. So please, come see the robots. And I will see you guys there. What did the fox say? Ring ding 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 ring ding 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 ring ding 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 ring ding 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 What did the fox say? Ring ding 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 ding